For decades, the Texas power grid has stood alone, isolated from the rest of the country. But now the federal government is planning to spend millions to change that. Texas first removed itself from the National Electrical System back in the 1930s, aiming to avoid regulations from FDR's administration. However, following a pair of power outages, which left millions in the dark this year, as well as blackouts during 2021's deadly winter storm that killed over 200 Texans, the Lone Star State is getting some federal assistance. Last week, the Department of Energy announced it will provide $360 million to help build what they're calling the Southern Spirit Line, which will connect Texas with Mississippi, Louisiana, and, in turn, the rest of the national power grid. This electricity transmission line would allow 3,000 megawatts to flow into and from the Texas grid, enough energy to power 750,000 homes. Currently, Texas has three existing connections to outside grids that are sometimes used to export power to other states. This new connection, though, will triple those interstate transmission capabilities and give Texas the ability to import power. Construction is expected to begin in 2028, with a projected completion date of 2031. While this plan falls short of the complete national grid reconnection some state officials had been advocating for, it will provide Texas with some of the power that they're projected to need in the coming years. Data centers essential for supporting AI and crypto operations can require the energy equivalent of a small city, and right now only one other state has more of them than Texas with additional facilities set to be built in the coming years, further straining a power grid that has been facing reliability questions for some time. To get more stories about U.S. energy, download the Straight Arrow News app and sign up for alerts from me, Jack Almer.